Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss a very important topic that is Agile, which is the most widely used software development methodologies. But have you ever wondered how Agile actually differs from other traditional models like Waterfall? So let's break it down into a simple terms and explore why Agile might be the right choice for modern software development. Let's start with the traditional model Waterfall. Imagine building a house, you finish the foundation then moves to the wall, then to the roofs. So there is no going back to make changes to the foundation later, right? So that's the waterfall. It's a sequential linear approach where each phase, starting from the planning, designing, uh, development and testing is completed before moving to the next stage. It's a rigid and does not adapt well with the changes. Whereas in Agile, it's like a building a house room by room. You start with one room, get, uh, deliver it, get the feedback and whatever feedback it gets, work on it and then move to the next room. Let's say first you start with the room or living room, you finish it and then move to the kitchen after getting the feedback. So this Agile uh, is all about the flexibility, you know, the collaboration and delivering the working software in a small iterative chunks. So let me provide an example. Imagine you're developing an e-commerce website with waterfall. You would spend months in planning, designing before even starting the coding phase. By the time the website is ready, maybe market demand has been changed. But with Agile, you would first build a simple feature like shopping cart, release it, gather feedback and then move to the next payment gateway. This way you are constantly improving based on the user feedback and delivering value with every step. So now that you know the key difference between Agile and Waterfall, I want to hear from you. Have you worked in Agile environment or do you prefer Waterfall? How do you compare Agile with other methodologies? Drop your thoughts and experiences in the comment and I would love to start a conversation. So that's all for today. Next time we'll explore another important Agile related topic. So stay tuned and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.